waiting for Billy's dad to bring the van. I'll show you all the stuff we've got. Here's my dad. <laughs> I'm taking this TV, I'm taking all this stuff. I'm taking this work desk. Waiting for him now, he's being quite wild to be honest. Starting to get a bit worried. So I'll see you when we start loading the van. <laughs> Slow and steady. Right guys, so I'm just in the coop now. To leave. Once we get there, I'll give you like a bit of an empty flat talk. I think the aim is, once it's fully furnished, that Izzy will come down and we'll do like a fully furnished flat tour. Maybe she can give some input. So, yeah, just on our way. Guys, so we just arrived. And then, this is our kitchen. It's like this lovely, grey kitchen. It's like really modern. And then, here, it's like a washer dryer Oops. a washer dryer and storage unit and then down here is like hello sir it's like a little dining area they left us gifts here which is so cute in a card so I'll open that on camera in a sec then this is the furniture we got we're going to put our TV here and then this is the view. So this is the full room. And then the bathroom. This is the wardrobe. It's quite a big wardrobe. And then here's the bathroom. So it's really nice and modern. Like the kitchen. And then if you come out of the bathroom here, then um, the, there's the door to the kitchen and the bathroom. And then here's the wardrobe. Then if you go through here, this is the bedroom with our little tables. Just as a little OTD, I have um, the two piece Latilia set on that we were gifted in the last Latilia haul. The two piece on with some Nike Air Forces. Hi guys, so we're just leaving. This is the first day we're able to use the gym. So me and Bill are just going to go down now and do a sesh. Apparently, he's letting us in before everyone else on Monday because it's Friday today. So we're going to like kind of review it for him. Um, I've still got like three boxes to pack away so I don't mind them but this is the gym fit I'm wearing React gym short leggings this like ASOS top and this the Zara um, black zip up from one of the holes and then I'm just wearing this little Lululemon bag that I got with Lululemon leggings because I'm going to take my water and keys and everything in there we're also um, thinking that we'll probably show you the rest of the amenities like there's a area that you can work in that has like wi-fi and coffee and tea and there's a roof terrace there's two of them and then there's a room you can rent out like if you want to have friends and families over so i think we're going to show you all of them as well some boxes we've got to take to the recycling and the first area is like this working area it's like it's kind of in the middle of the apartment, it's in the main block, and you can just work out here. There's free Wi Fi, and then there's this place, the hideaway, which is just <laughs> next door. And this is a little work area.
is basically the end of that. to be like a bit of an area where you can work on for the TV bill. And basically it's just, it's always empty because the buildings aren't like full capacity as of yet. It's got a toilet. It's got this little island. Oh. So you could work in here all day, like, so you're not trapped in your apartment sink, so you can make yourself drinks. And then it's got this little boiling water tap, so you can have tea or coffee. So this is one of the first things that attracted us to here, because we were like, rather than sitting in our apartment, it's a bit of a change of scenery, and there's so many seats here. We love this little area. So this is one of the first communal areas in the building, and we'll just walk up to show you the next. So these are the stairs. It's really cool design. They have lights all the way. Then this is the refectory. And basically you can hire this out for um Oh you have to hire it out. I'll just try and get some shots through the window. So, there's the kitchen area, there's a toilet just here, there's a dining table here, and there's a um, couch area here with a TV on the wall, and you can't get, basically you have to pay for this, but the only thing that you have to pay is a cleaning fee, I think it's, well it is, it's £20, so you pay £20 and then you can hire the room off for like, all day up until 12 o'clock midnight and um, they clean up after you so you don't have to do the cleaning either so it's basically just a cleaning free rather than a rental place so this is another thing that really attracted us because we thought if we have our friends or family around we can get on there pay the 20 pounds and then it's not the apartment that's like dirty at the end of the day like we can just walk out go back to the apartment just thought it'd be really good especially for like a match day yeah. Not the blue eyes. Not the blue eyes. So this is the courtyard. And we can't open this. The only one that you can't open with your fob is the um, one that you have to pay to rent, obviously. But this has like these heaters. Okay, I don't think they're connected yet, but basically it's going to have heaters. So you can sit out here in the winter. And this is just a scan of it. Just like a little garden um, rooftop terrace and it has like a nice view obviously there's some construction going on at the moment but it has like a little nice view look around there you can see the canal so this is the lifts guys Oh, forget it. I'm trying to get a freaking picture of myself. So this is the roof garden. And I think this is our pretend. This would be like the place that we would bring our friends. This has the best views of the two roof gardens. So it's also going to have the heaters. And then you can see over, this is the city centre. Is that is the city centre, yeah. isn't it? That's the train station, and then the canal is just over below here. But yeah, we just thought this would be perfect. Please come, have a few drinks with our friends, heat us on, bring some food, like it's free. This is the building we live at. This is the third building with the gym in, so it's probably like what, Bill? A minute walk. Yes. Maybe we're really excited. We're the first people to try it out. So they said that's because we were literally. I'm probably going to fall through the floor. <laughs> we have to sign waivers and everything. <laughs> Moment of truth. So he said to the right, and then to the right, didn't he? Oh, I can see it. Yeah! So, moment of truth, guys. Woohoo! Wow, so it's got a little toilet to the right, dumbbells, 
What's that called? The Smith and Weston bill? Yeah. It's got water tank, wipes to wipe down, mat, sperm machine, low row, balls, leg curl, leg extensions, that is skier, two treadmills, a bike, balls, what's that called? Cables. Cables, just some other machines. Yeah. Loving it guys. Woohoo! The view's amazing. Ooh. I think while we're living here it's never gonna be too busy with it just being um open so it's perfect guys. Free cost. Got all the machines you would need, not busy. I can't believe it, I think. So, Izzy, that was like, I know some more. Izzy's come to visit me and... <laughs> Sorry, you are in the corridor. <laughs> and the apartment is now almost fully furnished, so we're about to give you a furnished flat tour. This is my penis. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Izzy's like, she pretend it's my first look. Door's on the latch. <laughs> Coffee machine. Oh, it's still hot. Fresh, is it? Fresh pot. Just Freshly brewed, love. Freshly brewed oat milk latte. This is expensive. It looks expensive. This it was only like 130, I think. This has just made me a nice oat milk latte, and I'd recommend this machine. It's stunning. Yeah, it was. It was really For the nice. price, guys, this is really good. You can do latte, cappuccino, espresso, and then you can do like your own custom, which you is what I do. Chocolate. Yeah, because you just put the hot chocolate in and then um, do the milk, frappy milk. Oh. It's be good. And guys, just a side note on this cup, I've put it the other one away. We got these from um, John Lewis. I think it was like £20 for two or £25 for two. Really? <laughs> but it keeps drinks cool if they're cold and warm if they're hot. I think the liquid looks cool on them. So guys, um, I'll link these below, but these are from John Lewis. And then we've got a red open. <laughs> Standard. At least mum got us this from TK Maxx, I believe. So I'll link that, just a little kitchen roll. We wanted a wood to go with the theme. This is a microwave from John Lewis. These! I love them. Aren't they so good? They're so cool. And I'll link them below. I think it was like, and then, yeah, I think it was like £16 for three. So I'll link that. I just got tea, coffee and sugar. Did you buy this? <laughs> what does it say? Go get um, tiger. Guess who it's from? TK Maxx. Think of somewhere that you like, shop you like. Zara? No. Oh. Bit more high end. The stories. Oh, on the bonus. Yes. <laughs> we got this. Originally it was above the TV and it looked really good, but then Billy was like, if you put it there when you leave and it's like, go get him tired. <laughs> <laughs> it's this sends me on my way every day. Guys, we got it. This should have been £45 from all of the bonus. Stop it. But it had like little tiny marks out, gone out the corner. So she gave us it for 36 That's expensive. Oh, those. Yeah. Yes, that's, that is extortionate. Sorry, guys. We're, we're being robbed left, right? We got this rack from Dunelm. It was like £35, but it's really handy because when you wash the stuff, you can put like that over the sink. Is right? Yeah. Oh, Good, that, isn't it? So, you know. That's good, little. Uh, That's like stuff you didn't realise you need. Then we got these two chopping boards. Oh, they're modelled Master Chef chopping board. Master oh, Chef. Oh, Master Chef. Yeah. I love Master Chef. Little secret about me. Really Guys, the only thing I would say about wood chopping boards when you chop on them, it makes like these little Jess marks. Been too aggressive, it's Billy. The knives are really sharp. Do you know if the knives so sharp? Billy put it in the avo the other day and pulled it out, and the seed came out and stuck <laughs> on the knife. <laughs> So this goes really well with our wood theme, guys. Just loving the wood. And you know what else? I love this, like, thing at the back. Like a bit of mood lighting. It's a bit of mood lighting, guys. I'm making an espresso martini later with this, but we're going to make it in a dark. Anyway, stay tuned. We've got pips, seeds to put in them. Coffee beans now. No, we do need them. I have to put a few granules on them. <laughs> this is our, um, wait till you see inside this. It's a mess. This is our storage. That's a lot of space, then. Yeah. That's really good storage. Billy, but Billy was like, first day we hadn't even moved in. He's like, I know what we need. 
these hooks. I was like, F <laughs> off. Honestly, the stuff, the stuff was everywhere, guys. And he's <laughs> run out to get them hooks to put. He's got a brain on him, isn't he? He's annoying. <laughs> Included in the price of Mustard Dwarf, you get this thing, which is a washer dryer. So you can wash and dry your clothes. And then everything else we bought ourselves. Woohoo! This out, we keep these out, guys, because we don't want to waste space in the cupboards, and I think they look good. So, yeah, I love these bowls. This vase is from Morrison's. Um, these glasses were from IKEA. These, this set was from John Lewis, and I think we got like a full set for like forty-five pounds, like the all of them. So that was good. These are from H and M Home, and then we got the light with the apartment. Like the little speckles in the uh, dishes. Yeah, me too. So this is that, and then this is just my work desk that I have in here, so I can work, but it's from Next. Yeah, I need to get a proper one, but there's no space to put it. Yeah, that's true. So these are flowers that Izzy's mum bought us, and don't they go with the room really well? Yeah. Like the exact perfect colours for it. They actually know, aren't they? Yeah. I haven't even shown her pictures of what I read them. She's Jessica, please, cushions from Sense. They get really well together, didn't they? And then there was a bit of um, uncertainty about this one. But me little. In the middle. I think it brings them together. I think it's nice. Where's that one from? Home sense. I thought it looked like Mazzoni, and I yeah, thought, it looks like yeah. Oh yeah, I love that. And I was thinking, if it's got like pink, green, yellow, then it'll make sense why you've got all random cushions. No, I love it. Guys, this at the back was um, from Wilco's, and it was on half price from 16 to 8. But I just bought that, so, because this is a bit scratchy, so if you want to, like, lie down, you can just put that down. We got the coffee table from the company, so, unfortunately, I don't know where that's from. Um, this light, I'll show you it on. The light was from John Lewis. <laughs> And it has, you can adjust these heads, but I won't move them because this is the way they look best. Yeah, I think they look really cool. That chair, you'll yeah, have to try it. So. so this chair is from Next. It's really nice. You could fit a couple of people out of here, couldn't you? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> is he going to be asleep in a sec? Yeah, he's going to sit down for too long because, you know, yeah, will be asleep. This is from Home Sense Ball, so this is the same as these cushions. Goes nice to the colour, doesn't it? Oh, it'd be good to sit there with a coffee in the morning. Yeah, you? that's what that's what we said in the, in the morning time, but has it been done? Well, but you would always turn around, just watch all the builders. Do a bit of people watching. Yeah. Also got a bit of greenery in the apartment. Where's this from? Guys, we got these plants. Is this one. Banana leaf plant. And this one, is that what it is? I think it's a banana leaf plant, yeah. This is like a pale of string or something, and then is he say this is a banana leaf plant, but I think the proper yeah, name's <laughs> like a monster or something. Um, Monstoria. Um, something like that. Sorry, David. <laughs> <laughs> but these guys, these are from um, the plant point. I'll link the location below. It's a place in Leeds in the um <laughs> what's that shopping centre called? I'm not sure. Might be. It might I'm actually be these cards. Not gonna lie, none of them are from me. I know. <laughs> God shows you your true friends are, guys. <laughs> Billy's mum got us this Arnest sign from Next. Cute. This is a Yankee candle, don't know where the plant pot's from. And then, guys, this candle. Do you know loads of people actually messing me about this candle? Really? Yeah. Did you put an Insta over there? I just stood a story up. Did they actually? Yeah, I mean, like, my nan's friend told her she went to there. So that's one miss. <laughs> it's from TK Maxx, guys. It's massive. Is that it? That'll last you years, that. And it, smell, it smells quite strong, I think. But the, the thing I like about it is I think it looks quite nice, eh? Yeah. So. Oh, when it's not lit, there's not mm. really a candle, is there? No, there's actually oh, nothing, yeah. love. And then Billy's mum picked us up these. And you know what? When she bought them, I was like, God, they actually do go with the room really well, don't they? But yeah. I don't know where they're from. It looks like a bit of an olive bonus job, doesn't it? Yeah, they're nice. Because there's nothing worse than a tacky coaster, in my opinion. Oh. <laughs> the only thing worse than a pad of candles is a tacky coaster. <laughs> Guys, then you just come through here, and this is my... Um, I don't know what you'd call this. It's like a... <laughs> ooh, it's like a walk-through wardrobe. This is me and Izzy. No, see, look at the... Like, you look like a scarecrow in this light, don't you? 
Anyway, it's quite a big wardrobe, and guys, I got the uh, tw I got the seventy five percent of this. Jess and Billy have been having scraps about. We actually thing. have, but I came out on top. I like it. Oh, there's loads of stuff from the wall, there, isn't it? Isn't the shoe rack a good idea? Yeah. I was loving that. Did you just go out and buy them? Yeah. Guys, we got this for 20 or 16 pounds, I think, from um, Argos. But it's really long and you can extend it or bring it in. But so, yeah, I was buzzing about that really because where would my shoes have went? Yeah. So, this is my coat, then tops here. Then I have jeans on the other section. And then Billy has like a little, I'll show you Billy's little quarter. <laughs> no, That's no, Billy's no, quarter. No. <laughs> Yeah, yours, thank you. Is that yours? That's, uh, yeah. Come on. Then there's my jeans. Then that's all this. But wait, he hasn't got any more clothes, has he? Where's his pants? <laughs> this is work pants. Does this boy own pants? He took he took the he took a pair of jeans oh, with him in case he I goes out. I feel like boys are literally having two pairs of jeans. Is he's got ruined heels with her? And this is this is so far the pair of heels that I've got. What the dogs chewed. <gasps> Wait, are they the Zara ones that are quite new? Yeah, he chewed them after the first time I wore them and I still continued to wear them out. I suppose you can still wear them if you can't. It was just on that heel. I know. No. Guys, then you walk through here. I've got this IKEA like, mirror that was, um, I think it's the one everyone's got, but I want it. Billy's going to put it up on the wall, but we just haven't really. So guys, um, now we're in the bedroom and I'm just going to give you a little rundown where everything we've drawn the bedrooms from. But this is the one that's, this is the room that's probably the least complete and we want to get a picture and some more storage here. Like it's a bit yeah, so bear that in mind. Bear that in mind, don't judge me. And also I washed the bed yesterday. I washed a few arrival but now it's creased. So what do you do? Anyway, just, goodbye. I just couldn't be. You know what? Like, Jackson put it on the ironing board and iron it. Viv says that to me last year. And I was just, I'm, I'm like, don't bother. I don't care. It's creases. But people do, don't they? That's why it didn't work then, because I just held the pillows up and steamed it. Oh. <laughs> so. I just keep getting in the way of you wearing me to alive. Take us through it, love. I like the exposed concrete. So do I. I. So cool. And on the ceilings as well. Just, I as well. yeah, everyone has this. The yeah, standard I IKEA drawers. You probably don't even have to name it because everyone's probably already shouting at the screen. <laughs> 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 Is there any point me even linking it? Like, everyone's already got it. If you want another one, I'll link it. We've got a fan because it gets really hot on here, so we have to have this on overnight, which is annoying. We got these, like, these um, mirrors. From Dunelm, so we got two, one from either side of the bed. And then Billy wants to get like something to put in the middle, you know, like a picture thing because he said it looks too bare. So yeah. probably do that. Then these um marble lamps are from also Dunelm. They're so nice, I love that. Yeah, so do I. And I'd definitely take them with me. Mm -hmm. And then this little bedside table was actually given to us by the apartment people, so I have no idea where that's from. This bedding is also from Dunelm. It was the Duval. Is that what it's called? Duval, something like that range. It's like Egyptian cotton. So you and Sophie will have a good night's sleep. The mattress is a bit hard though because it's new. Do you know what I like? Because right near the way you've got USB points everywhere. Yeah, that's what Billy said. Because her and Sophie are staying in here tonight. Me and Billy stuck them up with sticky back plastic things from Wilco because. We didn't want to put nails in the wall, so there's a good chance they might come dropping. Yeah, this pillow was from Dunelm yeah, too. I know. Billy was like, that pillow is so squirrely. There's no way I'm buying that. I, know, I like it. I like it. And Billy got this love heart teddy. I love that. It's I, so cute. I don't know where it's from, guys, to be honest, but you probably Google it. And then this is the same as the half price wool who won in the other room. And then this is the classic IKEA mall. <laughs> Mom. Mom. This is an air purifier. This chair, is it you have this, don't you? Yeah. Um, do you is that? Oh no, the range. Oh yeah, that's from the range, that one. It's from the range, love And you put it up in price, you know, when, when we got it, I think it was like 50, 50 wasn't it? or something, I'm sure, and I was certainly nearly 70. <gasps> Yeah. They it knew was, it was I popular. Because Ikea, you have one that was just selling out so much. And I think the Ikea one was about 80 to start with. So that's probably why. Yes, guys, this mirror was 20 quid from Aldi. <gasps> For Aldi? I know. I would never think to look there for home furniture. No, it was just on the special buys when I went to Aldi one day, so I picked it up and walked it home because I lived down the road from Aldi and... Did you walk home with it? Yeah. 
it was it was it was stressful to be honest so me and Billy have actually put this one up with one singular nail but Billy said it's not very secure so there's also a chance that will go crash bang in the night so that's everything from this room I think guys um also just to let you know if you were looking at buying the apartment the apartment comes with underbed storage which I'll just show you Stuff, my bags, and then my Dyson, and then I think these are just clothes. These three. So yeah, is that, is that heavy to lift up? Um, yeah. yeah. But it's it's not as heavy because the strap. So you get the strap too, guys. So yeah, this is good storage. <gasps> Walk out here back to the mirrored space. I just went down. <laughs> here is the bathroom. Guys, so this is the bathroom. We got these blue towels from John Lewis. They're like the any day range, which is like, I think like John Lewis value. So they're like, it was, they were really cheap. I think they, these ones were like four pounds. I think they were like six. The only thing I'd say about them towels is they shed blue stuff everywhere. The bathroom comes with this little hook. So I just put my dressing gown on there. Then we bought this bin from, this bin was three pounds from Wilco. Oh, what a steal. Harriet bought us this from, Tesco, I actually think it smells really nice. We got, we actually got these on half price from, you, you'll have to have a bath. I mean, oh no, you won't, will you? But you won't, wait, when would you right, have Right, because they're soft. Oh, Mr. God, it's, they, really? they just knock you out. Let me smell. They knock you out, they were half price, we from couldn't where? resist. In boots. Yeah. We can't get up, but we have a bath with them. And then, um, yeah, just, you get a shower. You get a big shower head. I think it is good to wash your hair with because it's quite powerful. It's not. Um, it's big, so it's good to wash your hair with, but it's not really that powerful. Oh, but this one, you can knock the dial on it to, and then make it go thinner and really powerful. Then you get this under cupboard store, which is really handy because you don't have to have all stuff out on the side then. So that's good under the sink. Then we got this marble. And did you buy that or did it come with? No, I bought it. I like that. Where's it from? Jealous. Was it pricey? I think that was 25, that was 20. <gasps> I know, guys. This is from John Lewis, and this is the matching soap dispenser from John Lewis. And then, guys, they, uh, I don't know if you can see, but like, there's this shelf in the bathroom, part of the mirror, and you can put all stuff in it, but then, when you're like far away, you can't see the stuff. Yeah, such a good idea. Yeah, and like, at first, when we first moved in, anything that was big, I like lied down so you couldn't see it, but then, it, like, it got annoying, so. No, I just have them I mean, like. You've got to do my own, but you've got to show it off. Haven't I know, but this like could maybe do with knocking that down. There we go. A bit better. The mirror is massive. Yeah. I love it. So, is that everything? Do you think covered in the bathroom? Um. Yeah, I think so. Oh, this is also from John Lewis, and it was on reduction. It's a bit of a weird shape for a bath mat, like it's square, but it was on reduction to five, I think. Five pounds. Five quid. I think so, or maybe 10, but yeah, I think that. Yeah. Nope. It is the end of the flat tour. We hope you enjoyed seeing the flat and the moving process. Um, if you have any questions about anything in the flat that we maybe didn't cover, or anything about Mustard Dwarf, if you're thinking about moving in there, comment or you can DM. Feel free. On Instagram. Yeah, DM me on Instagram or comment below and I'll let you know about it. And any questions about Leeds? I've only been here for about an hour. And it looks nice. It is. I'm guys. impressed already. I'm getting good vibes. It's a nice city. I'm pleasantly surprised by it. I think we've covered all bases. So if you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. And thanks for watching.